All right, so this is Gut Grinder. Um, what do we got? We got the soft people are being attacked by something called the Gut Grinder that's eating their gold, so they cover it with a cup. But then they take it out of the cup, and they admit this was kind of a bad idea because then the Gut Grinder eats the gold again. And everyone thinks it's Jake because this thing apparently looks like Jake and is huge, and... Jake is so drawn in by this that he actually thinks he might be the Gut Grinder, but he can't be because Finn watches him when he sleeps. But when does Finn sleep? Justice never sleeps. Yes. I was... Better than any Batman out there. I was disturbed by both those. <laughs> Not the fact that he takes pictures? Three of those <laughs> I was very disturbed by. Um... Yeah, that, that was like, that was probably the funniest line, but it's also like really creepy. Yeah. It's the first time Finn's like, and, and they draw me a lot of weird ways, but it's like, oh, whatever, a little boy, fun, haha. It's like, no, that was creepy. Yeah. And the way his eyes get really big, like, you know, I watch you when you sleep. <laughs> so, okay, so they go and uh, Jake turns himself self in thinking he's the gut grinder and then... Uh, Finn lures out the real gut grinder, which is really the Sharpie mayor's wife who just wants gold so she can buy things and dressed up like Jake because she thinks Jake is hot. Now, my question with that is, does that technically make her a transvestite because she's dressing like a man because she finds it hot? Well, I, I don't think it's transvestite. I think uh, it's more along the lines of, like, cosplay. That's more the way I look at it. It's more cosplay. Because she kind of wants to be Jake, in a sense. But it's dressing as the other gender, so... But only briefly, just to steal gold. Kind of like weirdos that go to cons and dress like you. Except I technically steal their gold, because I sell merchandise. Well, that's not stealing. That's more... Well, if they don't like the product, it's kind of stealing, but... They buy it, so... Yeah, so... Come to my cons. They're coming up soon. Uh, 1 December. He's going to be the 1 December, too. Go see Forced Viewing, also. What's that address again? <laughs> ForcedViewing.com Yeah. Go to YouTube and see my first video. It's called The Drudgeon's Dungeon. I review ghoulies. Also got a website, TheGuyWithGlasses.com. You might have heard of it. What's that? So what do you think of this episode? Actually, this is one of the few episodes I was not a fan of. You know, I was just about to say the same thing. I think I thought this one was actually kind of a dull one. <laughs> and considering it's the season finale, and yes, you people may sit there and go, that's not the proper order or whatever, that's what it is on the DVD, and that's where I see it almost all the time. It's kind of a letdown as a season finale. I mean, it's well, I think the thing about, at the very least, this first season is it doesn't seem like it's going in any particular order like some things do come back and some characters come back but it's not it's not like it's essential you see this first episode in order to understand yeah. these other ones i mean they explain it pretty well if you're not caught up i mean even if you don't know who the ice king is it's like they kind of set up in each episode you get the gist pretty fast um you know there's there's never a last time on adventure time you know sort of thing it's not needed yeah uh so i out in this season at least they were going for something like that like hey we gotta really leave them on something strong for the season finale my guess is they probably just picked and choose which one you know to do uh you know just like okay maybe this one end on maybe this you know or, hell they probably picked the least entertaining one to end on because it's like well they've seen the rest and <laughs> i mean his <laughs> hero would have been a great one to end on mm -hmm. like that's just a really top-notch episode and like this one was just kind of like it was kind of boring and kind of basic. Like, it follows a really relatively simple plot, and it's not as bizarre and random as every other episode pretty much in this season. Yeah, that's really what I was sort of noticing is that, like, you know, boy, there really was sort of like this, when the other ones would get so random, they would be so constantly random and just so constantly crazy, and I think that was just... Maybe that's why it felt a little dull, because it's like, you know, eh, just sort of... Like you said, it's a straightforward story... And I, I miss sort of that craziness not knowing where it's going. Though I thought maybe he was going to sleepwalk, but... <laughs> I mean, I, I, I guess I couldn't predict exactly what the ending was, but... Yeah, just not not as much randomness, not as much craziness. So, so it didn't do too much for me. Um, yeah. it, all except the I watch you when you sleep line. Like, that, that was a, a creepy but also funny line. 
Uh, well, I do like when it. they're running up to the gut grinder and they're like, cut him open, cut open his stomach. Yeah, no, and then when they actually cut him off, I'm like, oh my god! And it's like, oh, it's a costume, okay. But I did sort of do like a double take, like, holy crap, like they did that <laughs> on a kid show? It's like, but yeah, obviously it's just Glock. Um, yeah. But, uh, yeah, I'm trying to think if there's any other, like, major stuff with this one. I mean, I can't, I can't think of too much to say about it. I um, did like the old guy who's in prison just because he likes the grubs. And he takes the little grub and tosses it in his mouth, and you see the little guy just like... <laughs> I, I get, the one other thing I'll say is that there, I, I did laugh a little bit just at the design when uh, Jake gets his feet the size of fins, but he doesn't change anything else. I thought that was kind of cool. Actually, it's very self to know the more I think about like the giant animals that suddenly have like the really yeah. thin uh, uh, legs. Um, so I thought that was kind of funny. It, yeah. I liked when the bag ripped open. When Finn's backpack opened up and there's underwear and an oh, eyeball it's like an eyeball, and a potion yeah. and just random things. And the viola. The all-powerful viola. Actually, one other thing I'll comment, comment on is when Jake thinks he's the gut grinder and he's trying to, you know, go like, ah, I am the gut grinder. All I could think of was Phelan whenever he <laughs> does his, like, his yelling voice, like, you know, rawr, rawr, I'm, I'm the rock fighter. Yeah. It's like, I, I really got that watching this. Um, and I don't know if it's just me. Well, watch the episode if you haven't, guys. Just, just tell me if that's just me or not. Uh, I'm never going to see really that curious. ever again the same way <laughs> <laughs> so it's it, it, now everyone will tune into this episode even though it's like probably not popular and those be like, oh, see, that dude sound like Phelan so um, I do love when Jake runs up and grabs Finn from under the gut grinder and just hucks him yeah just the throws him yeah I mean that, that, that got a little less there, there's a couple like little less I mean it's not like awful or yeah. anything I mean it's not like oh my god what an insult I mean it's not that at all but yeah just sort of yeah just sort of mediocre. So um, out of all my out of all the episodes so far that I've seen, it's one of my least liked, though. Yeah. So it's and it doesn't mean it's horrible. It just no. means you know, eh, like, like it was definitely one where I was sort of becoming aware of the time. Like you know, okay, let's um, what the next one's about? <laughs> you know, yeah. Sort of thing. So, but yeah, it wasn't painful or anything. So um, yeah. yeah, there it is. Any other parting words? Dougie, why did you eat my fries? You have fries? You go watch me while I sleep, aren't you? Who says I don't already? She left me in the house. <laughs> this isn't funny. Don't laugh for that. No, it's really funny. Because when you sleep, you have no idea what goes on. You, you think you're famous just because your videos? No, you have to see how many pictures are... <clears throat> Hi.